Once upon a time, in a serene village nestled between misty mountains and tranquil rivers, there lived a Zen master named Haruki. Haruki was known for his wisdom and the ability to unveil profound truths through simple yet profound stories. One day, a curious traveler named Aiko arrived at the village seeking the wisdom of the renowned Zen master. Intrigued by the tales of Haruki's insight, Aiko approached the modest wooden hut where the master resided. Master Haruki, Aiko bowed respectfully. I have traveled far in search of wisdom. Teach me the secrets of the universe. Haruki, with a twinkle in his eyes, invited Aiko to sit by the small pond behind his hut. The surface of the pond was like a perfect mirror, reflecting the surrounding trees, the azure sky, and the dancing butterflies. Reality is like this pond, Haruki began, gesturing towards the water. It reflects what is, without judgment or distortion. But, Aiko, what do you see when you look into this mirror? Aiko pondered for a moment and replied, I see the trees, the sky, and the butterflies, all the things that exist around the pond. Haruki nodded approvingly. Indeed, the mirror shows what is. Now close your eyes and imagine a dragon soaring through the sky, breathing fire. Aiko complied, shutting his eyes, and envisioned a magnificent dragon painting the sky with flames. Now open your eyes, Haruki instructed. As Aiko opened his eyes, he was surprised to see the reflection of the imagined dragon on the pond's surface. The dragon, though a creation of Aiko's mind, appeared as vivid and real as the trees in the sky. Haruki smiled. The mirror reflects not only the tangible but also the intangible. Your thoughts, dreams and perceptions are like the dragon in the mirror of reality. Aiko marveled at the revelation. But, Master Haruki, what is the ultimate truth? The Zen master chuckled. The ultimate truth, dear Aiko, is that the mirror itself is beyond reflection. It remains untouched, clear and serene, regardless of what appears in it. Just like the stillness within you that observes the dance of thoughts and illusions without being consumed by them. As Aiko contemplated the profound lesson, he realized that reality was indeed a mirror. A mirror reflecting the external world and the internal landscape of the mind. Master Haruki's wisdom became a guiding light, teaching Aiko to embrace the clarity within the mirror of existence and to appreciate the dance of reflections without attachment. And so, the traveler left the village carrying the timeless teachings of the Zen master, forever grateful for the revelation that reality is, indeed, a mirror.